Well, last night, the Tigers jumped on the Black Knights and really never looked back. Because then we get a look here. Here's, here's the penalty that resulted in the penalty shot. And then uh, Nolan Dakota. As uh, Hearn got loose, and Dakota did what he had to do, and, and the, but Jordan Ruby came up big, stymieing Hearn on the penalty shot. Behind the net, that's not to say, though, that it's going to be easy for the Tigers. Friday night's game in Buffalo will be on national television on CBS. It's now the fifth in front of the goal. Lynch putting it in, and the Tigers go up 1-0. That was tremendous. Rather than Lynch trying to maybe poke it or one-time it, put it on his stick. And then you get Creel over committing, and then Lynch with the easy goal. I love, look at noise with the cross side pass. And then watch this beautiful to a cutting. Let's not look, put that on his stick. I love what he did here. Look at that, perfect. Shumway finds Lynch, and Lynch has some room cutting up the center of the ice. Lynch gains the zone, winds up, shoots and scores! How about that? And Lynch, he's got two. Tigers do nothing. Love the way Lynch has been playing this year, one of their assistant captains. I love what he did there. Instead of forcing it, he pulled it back. And then, listen, watch this. Get some uh, puck across here. Mid-ice gets across the blue line. All right, let me pull up here. Everyone's starting to retreat. I've got a lane. Let me fire it up. And now Army with a chance to bring it out of the zone as Kozlak has it intercepted. Kukali was able to hold it in. Shua now cutting to the net. Shua, nice work. Scurving the back end. It's put back in! And again, scurving always around the puck. Once again, able to get his stick on it, can't convert, but there's Schuler, who's also around the net. Nice backhand there by scurving here. And then Schuler able to punch it in. A lot of years, it's just everybody's on, on, on par with each one, each team. Dakota blocking that shot in front, and Kozlak was not able to connect. Army applying some pressure here. They're looking for their first goal this weekend. Sorry, pass in front, and a goal, and there it is. That's number 13, C.J. Ruchlin with the goal, and it's three to one. So for Ruchlin, that is his team leading eighth goal. All right, that's, a, that's the way to start a period. And now if you're armed. Another goal right out in front, it's three to two. Joe Koslak putting this one home. Well, nobody picks up Koslak. Nobody picked him up. I mean, Koslak skates right in front. This can't happen. Watch Koslak here, look at this. He just has a lane. I mean, that's back to the, the Rabel's got his back to the play. No one knows what's going on. Carlisle has it. Koslak back up top, this goes. Ruchley, right down in front, rebound in front. Oh, what a glove save by Ruby. Jordan Ruby with his glove. <laughs> Stopping Army. Back to back, big time save. Kozlak can't believe he didn't score. Initial save here, here comes the rebound. Kozlak poking at it right there. And Jordan on his belly making saves. There's the initials. Kozlak thought he had the goal there when he punched it in. Then he gets another crack at it. Right inside the blue line. Greg Noyes, senior defenseman. Noyes coming down low. Right over to Kolovecchia, shoots. Knocked down in front by Nick. 104 remaining in the Tiger power play. Kolovecchia scores! Michael Kolovecchia! And the Tigers have gone up 4 2 on the power play. Like what Kolovecchia did, got the puck back, tried to find a little bit of an alleyway for him to go a window, and he found one. And I don't know if it's real. Was screened here. Kolovecchia then looks, looks. All right, he skates in, winds up. Oh, I don't know if Schuler was kind of in the vision of Creel, but anyway, Kolovecchia, we've seen this this year, his entire career. He's got a nasty shot. On the power play. So I will read Kolovecchia from Noyes and Dakota, but quickly, Army comes right back. Right back, Clint Carlisle, they put the pressure on. They came right back, almost caught RIT napping a little bit. They fired, they just dumped the puck into the corner, went down and chased it. 
and then firing it towards the net was Luke Jenkins, and then there's Clint Carlisle right on the doorstep. Look at the puck, just kind of skates right off of Jordan. Will. Held in. Lauer shoots it to the opposite side. 15 seconds remaining. Tigers, if they can get one more clear, that would do it. Army doing a great job of just keeping it in here. The noise is noise freezing, is the, freezing puck. the puck. <laughs> Greg Noise, smart hockey, and the Tigers are going to hold on for the win. Well played there by Noise. And the Tigers, it wasn't pretty, Gino, but they found a way to get the win and close out this game. Wasn't easy, but they get the weekend sweep.